everyone, my name is Alejandra Reyes and this is my video editing statement for Brian Johnson's multimedia class here at the College of Media at the University of Illinois in Champaign-Urbana. Um, for this assignment, uh, project number five, I had to complete an audio story along with photos. So essentially a video, photo, audio story. And so um, I really did like it. The audio and video story had to be of an interesting place, so I decided to hit up a New Life Tattoo on Green Street in Champaign. It um, is a place that I've been to before, and I just thought it was uh, very, very cool. There's a lot of artwork displayed on the walls. There's a lot of um, just knickknacks around, oh, lunch boxes, uh, the outline of a really muscular, tough guy with tattoos that you can take photo with. So there's just some really cool things in the shop. So I kind of, um, I really thought that that was an interesting place. And I hope you feel the same way too. Uh, for the audio part, I interviewed Lunchbox, who's an artist at New Life. He's been there for, been tattooing there for 10 years. And so um, he's really well known in the community. So I thought that'd be something really cool to incorporate. I also interviewed to um, UIUC students who have been tattooed by him. They talk about their interaction with him as well as their tattoo and you see photos of their tattoo. Um, for the photos that I included, um, I of course got a photo of the outside of the building just so you know exactly um, the place that you're looking at so you see new life. Um, I got a lot of the photos of all the interesting things that I described inside of the building, um, inside of the tattoo shop. So you see those lunch boxes, you see all the art on the wall. A lot of it was drawn by Lunchbox and Tilt and some of the other tattoo artists who um, run the shop. So I thought that that's really interesting. So I really hope you enjoy that stuff. Um, I included some photos courtesy of Lunchbox of some other work that he's done. Um, just so you kind of get a feel for what he can do. Um, I also included photos of Shannon and Victoria's tattoos. I really like this project. I thought it was a good way for me to um, incorporate all kinds of different photos along with audio, something I'd never really done before. I've never done an audio story, um, including photos. Um, yeah, so uh, there's my project. Um, it's not exactly perfect, but it's my first it's my first assignment like this. I think I could have um, probably worked on the audio a bit better. Um, the one concern that I do have in it is the shop had some music playing in the background, which is great for um, during the interview. You have that music in the background. But then when it comes to the girls, I kind of interviewed them in a more, um, it just so happened that we were in a more quiet setting. So that's kind of an issue. Not all the photos necessarily look identical. So the lighting's different. Um, I'm not sure if that's something that you may or may not enjoy. Um, shooting the photos was a little bit difficult. I had to try to adjust all the camera settings, um, white balance try different modes only because the lighting in the tattoo shop was pretty weird, but um, hope you enjoyed my final project.